Sporting is the best club in the world. The rhythm of handball passion has come to Lisbon. Sporting CP is the flagship of Portugal's rising handball scene. And Frankis Carl is a part of it. Sporting means a lot to me. It feels like a second home. I've been here for nine years now. It's the only club I have spent my life at as a professional player. I came here directly from Cuba, and yes, it's a second home for me. Sporting have been part of the Velux EHF Champions League for three years in a row now, and are not only representing a country. An idea of developing handball is deeply connected with the Lions as well. We think that we are doing something good for Portuguese handball, and we want to be in Champions League to play with the best teams, of course. We think that it's very important to be in Champions League because we can have better players, uh, to have better younger players to come to our club. Last season, that concept took the Portuguese to the round of the last 16, where they challenged Vesprem and lost only after a tough battle in both games. This was really good for, for our fans, for our players, for, and we, we make uh, very good uh, games at home and uh, out, and this is, uh, I think that we want to make this, uh, this again and meet a, a big club again in the uh, last 16. To stay strong as a team and to become stronger by acquiring the big names, that's the future plan at Sporting CP. I think that Sporting are getting closer to the bigger clubs in Europe from the organisational perspective. I can see that they're investing a lot and that they want to be close to the bigger European clubs. For sure the club needs time to achieve something like that, but I think that the people in the club have the best intentions. I'm sure if they continue to grow like this, Sporting will become a very serious club and will attract many good players. What goes for the players goes for the coaching too. Prior to the season, former HBC Nantes coach Thierry Anti took over at Sporting. Hey, for the moment I'm really satisfied because we are first in championship and we, we try to be in the last uh, 16 team in, in uh, Champions League. So for the moment I'm really happy. Sporting play their elimination games against Dynamo Bucharesti. It's the same matchup as last year, and Thierry Anti seems convinced that Sporting's journey continues to the last 16. So I want to hear again this uh, beautiful uh, uh, Champions League music. Handball's rhythm has come to Lisbon, and it's here to stay.